the shadow of the Gateway Arch stands historic St. Louis Union Station. It was built in 1893. At the time, it was the largest train station in the world. Until the mid 20th century, railroads were the primary way to travel across the country. In the 1940s, 100,000 passengers per day passed through Union Station. Each day, 260 trains would arrive and depart. The number of tracks needed to accommodate this volume of traffic was staggering. The train shed had 42 tracks, totaling 18 miles. With the rise of air travel, passenger trains began a steep decline. The station closed in 1978. In 1970, Union Station was designated a National Historic Landmark. And in 1985, it was renovated to include a 500-room hotel, shopping mall, and fine restaurants. It is now a major attraction in St. Louis. The Grand Hall has been restored to its former glory. The main entrance shines again with gold and stained glass. The station's hotel has been modernized, but the atrium maintained its original charm and elevators. The old waiting area for boarding trains has been transformed into a large public area and events venue. Perhaps the largest transformation is to the train shed. The once crowded, smoky, and noisy area where passengers would board trains is now an open and peaceful oasis. It features fine dining, a food court, and is now home to the new St. Louis Aquarium. The outside area includes a beer garden and a large Ferris wheel. Not to be missed is the evening light show. The Grand Hall is converted to a large multimedia theater with laser projection and surround sound. It is a highlight of a visit to Union Station. <laughs>